Porter Stansbury is back with a new stock teaser. This one is a warning against AI stocks and instead recommends energy stocks. He's claiming the big AI die-up is coming and recommends reading his Dirty Energy Fortress special report to prepare. Like always, Porter wants you to give him money to get his stock recommendations, but I have good news. He left enough clues in the presentation to figure out the stocks. I reveal them in this video and give you information on the stocks so you can determine if they're worth investing in or not. Let's get started, and if you're looking to get the best stock picks, make sure to click the link in the description to see Insider Weekly. It's only $1 to try and is easily beating the market over the last few years. Before we get into the stocks, let's break down the teaser first. Before AI exploded earlier this year, the big focus of the market and stock pickers was natural gas. The idea was that the Russian-Ukraine war would create a higher need for natural gas production in America. This is the essence of the teaser from Porter. He wants you to avoid the fool's gold that is AI and stick to something that's going to perform well for years, which is energy and natural gas. Porter does recommend a coal company as well. There are many reasons why natural gas is expected to grow. Natural gas is a fossil fuel that is composed of methane. It is the cleanest burning fossil fuel, and it is a versatile resource that can be used for a variety of purposes, including electricity generation, heating and cooling, transportation and industrial processes. Here are some of the specific benefits of natural gas. Cleaner burning, abundant, versatile and affordable. Overall, natural gas is a clean, abundant, versatile, and affordable energy resource that can play an important role in the transition to a clean energy future. Let's take a look at the stocks Porter is teasing now. The first stock is Peabody Energy and this is the only stock in this teaser that isn't a natural gas stock. Peabody Energy is a leading global pure play coal company and a member of the Fortune 500, serving power and steel customers in more than 25 countries on six continents. The company was founded in 1883 and is headquartered in St. Louis, Missouri, United States. Peabody Energy produces coal from surface and underground mines located in the United States, Australia, and Colombia. The company's coal is used to generate electricity and produce steel. Peabody Energy also provides a range of coal-related services, including transportation, logistics, and marketing. Peabody Energy is a major player in the global coal industry. In 2022, the company produced over 200 million tons of coal. Peabody Energy's coal is used by some of the world's largest utilities and steelmakers. Peabody Energy is committed to sustainable mining practices. The company has a number of initiatives in place to reduce its environmental impact, including investing in renewable energy and energy efficiency measures. Peabody Energy is also working to develop new technologies to reduce greenhouse gas emissions from coal-fired power plants. Peabody Energy is a significant contributor to the global economy. The company employs over 10,000 people and generates billions of dollars in revenue each year. Peabody Energy also supports thousands of jobs in the coal supply chain. The second stock is Viper Energy Partners. Viper Energy Partners LP is a publicly traded partnership that owns mineral and royalty interests in oil and natural gas properties in the Permian Basin in West Texas. Viper's assets are leased to working interest owners who bear the costs of operation and development. Viper Energy is a subsidiary of Diamondback Energy, one of the largest oil producers in the Permian Basin. Viper benefits from Diamondback's expertise in developing and operating Permian assets, as well as its strong financial position. Viper Energy's business model is to provide unit holders with an attractive return by focusing on business results, maximizing distributions, and pursuing accretive growth opportunities. Viper's distributions are variable and are dependent on the performance of its underlying assets. Viper Energy is a good investment for investors who are looking for exposure to the Permian Basin oil and gas sector. The Permian Basin is one of the most productive oil and gas regions in the world, and Viper has a strong track record of generating cash flow and returning it to unit holders. The third stock is Blackstone Minerals. Blackstone Minerals is a Houston, Texas-based oil and natural gas mineral and royalty company. It owns and operates mineral and royalty interests in over 40 states and 60 productive basins in the United States, with a focus on onshore oil and natural gas assets. Blackstone Minerals' mineral and royalty interests are primarily concentrated in the Permian Basin, Haynesville Shale, Eagle Ford Shale, and Marcellus Shale. The company was founded in 1980 and went public in 2007. It is a master limited partnership, which means that it is a publicly traded partnership that passes through most of its income to its investors. Blackstone Minerals is one of the largest mineral and royalty companies in the United States. Blackstone Minerals' business model is to acquire and manage mineral and royalty interests. The company generates revenue from royalties on oil and natural gas production from its properties. 
Blackstone Minerals also generates revenue from lease bonuses and other payments from oil and gas companies that lease its properties. Blackstone Minerals is a leading provider of mineral and royalty interests to the oil and gas industry. The company's asset base is well diversified across geographic regions and geologic formations. Blackstone Minerals is also well positioned to benefit from the continued growth of the oil and gas industry in the United States. The fourth stock is Tellurian. Tellurian Inc. is a natural gas company that is developing a portfolio of natural gas production, LNG marketing and trading, and infrastructure. Its flagship project is the Driftwood LNG liquefaction and export facility in Louisiana, which is expected to have a capacity of 27.6 million metric tons per annum when completed. Tellurian is also developing the Driftwood Pipeline, which will transport natural gas from the Haynesville Shale Basin to the Driftwood LNG facility. Tellurian was founded in 2016 by Sharif Suki and Martin Houston, two industry veterans with experience in LNG development and marketing. The company's management team also includes several other experienced executives from the oil and gas industry. Tellurian is a publicly traded company with its stock listed on the NYSE American under the symbol TELL. The company's headquarters is located in Houston, Texas. Tellurian's projects are still in the development stage, and the company has not yet generated any revenue. However, the company has secured a number of long-term LNG supply contracts with customers in Europe and Asia. Tellurian is also seeking financing to complete its projects. Tellurian's goal is to become a leading global LNG producer and exporter. The company believes that its low-cost natural gas resources and its experienced management team give it a competitive advantage. So that's the end of my video covering Porter Stansbury newest teaser. So what do you think? Are you going to avoid AI stocks and stick to natural energy? Or are you not convinced AI is a bubble? Let me know in the comments what you think.